Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas. It's that time of the year again. We finally made it and we got there. I finally got everything done, thank God. <laughs> and we're here, mm. Christmas Day. Hopefully you are all having a great Christmas wherever you are around the world. It's um, trying times at the moment again with all this COVID crap, but hopefully you can all be with your loved ones that you, you need to be with for Christmas. I thought today I'll have another drink with you. I've got my mum and dad here as well, so they'll pop on and say hello. Um, and none of the kids are here yet. We're still waiting for them all to turn up. So, hey Kim, how are you darling? Is he a Kim? Hey Kimmy. Yeah, yeah. So I thought once again, I'll try. Oh, Nita's on. Hi Nita. Nita's on mum and dad. Mum and dad are here, Nita. They'll get on in a minute. <laughs> you keep the edge Oh, got it. A bit early for me. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit early, but the quicker we have one, the quicker we, <laughs> we can calm down sometimes. Oh, Tara Lee's on. Hi, darling. How are you? Hi Debbie, hi Jennifer. Hey Kip, yeah, Merry Christmas to you and Linda too. So, I hope everyone's gonna have a wonderful day today. We've got beautiful weather, but once again, just like my birthday when we were sitting out here, they're threatening that this afternoon we may have a thunderstorm. So <laughs> let's hope it's not a big hail and bloody white out like we did on my birthday. So we'll wait and see what today's weather's like. Oh, you'll be here in a few hours, darling. Yeah, okay. No one's here yet. Uh, Dylan and Renee and that aren't here yet. Hi, Sean. Hi. Sheila. Sorry, I've got to put my glasses on to see all the names. Sheila and Megs. Eddie. Hi, Eddie. How are you, darling? So, oh, I'll be right now. <laughs> We'll get there slowly, a little bit at a time. Hi Natalie, how are you? And what have you all got planned? Uh, in America and Canada and, and England, it'll be all snowing over there for you for Christmas, won't it? We have a beautiful, well, luckily today, we have a beautiful sunny day. <laughs> Australian Christmas, hot. Yeah, hot, mm. yeah. It's supposed to be about 30, 30 degrees today. Um, we're Celsius over here, so that's going to be a nice one. At least it's not a 40 degree day and we'll be just melting messes. So it'll be fun. I um, Oh, I'll show you some of my, my shaky nen gifts today. Now, you've all said Jenga before. So this is a normal Jenga. I want to show you these. This is a wobbly worms Jenga. So it's... Um, they're different little pieces that all sort of fit together and you roll the dice and work out what colour to pull out. And then, uh, could you pick that one up for me? Have a look at this one guys, remember I found the big pickup sticks? <laughs> look at this Jenga and it's heavy, it's real heavy, look at the size, of, you could build a cupboard with these pieces of wood. <laughs> oh, it's in two halves. Oh. Look at the size of those bits of wood. So that might be one I might be able to do. <laughs> I don't think I'll be able to do the little ones. So one day I'll have to try the, the Jengas for you. Hi Malona, how are you darling? Hi Linda. Oh. So they'll be fun. Um, not but we'll give them a try one day so, mum do you want to come and say hello this is my mum everyone my mum robin hi everyone <laughs> want to wish you all a merry christmas and a happy new year <laughs> mum's a bit shaky too um she's 
that's just a bit she's of medication. She's on the medications <laughs> at the moment, yeah. She's yep. got a pinched nerve in her neck, so yeah. she's been having a bit of a hard time with that. Yep. Hopefully we get that all fixed up for you soon. Yep, yep. Hi yeah. Nita, how are you going? <laughs> yeah, all have a good Christmas with all your family and hug them close. Yeah. So we've, um, Bubby's going well. He, um, he's not here yet, so I can't show him. He's so beautiful, he's so tiny though. The other day um, when Renee got out of hospital because we couldn't go and visit her in the hospital with COVID, um, the COVID rules. So when she came home and from the hospital, she came here and picked Bronte up and I had a little nurse of her and she said, mum, get him out the car, you can get him out of his car seat. And I said, oh no, darling, you better do that. <laughs> And I said, just put him in my arms. And I held him and then I said to her, okay, you gotta get him out of my arms now. And and um, so today will be my big test where I can have a big cuddle with him. And, I'm first. Um, no. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I am. No. Yes, I am. Nens are first before I'm the great, great Nens. <laughs> I get him first. Yeah. So it'll be great. And, He's, um, he's doing really well. We haven't had his MRI results yet, so we'll get them soon and um, hopefully then we'll find out if he's got any little challenges or not. Hi Suzanne, how are you? So um, we're gonna have all the family here for Christmas today. Um, my brother and, and sister and their families and their kids and all of our kids and our grandkids, so it's going to be a great day, hopefully. Um, can't it'll wait till they all get here. Yeah, yeah, it'll all be good. I had a little tear this morning because it, it, there weren't any kids here opening presents. And, uh, you know, when you're so used to them here all the time, it gets a yeah. little sad when they're not. And then the Emily time. come out of a bedroom. Yeah. And we said, we found a kid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the, we had to wait for yeah. Emily to wake up. <laughs> Come and say hi. And here's my dad, Dennis. Yeah. He's going to come and say hello to you. Get on the, the back here. Yeah. <laughs> how you going? Yeah. Merry Christmas to all. Yeah. yeah. Hi, Jeffrey. How are you? So I'm uh, getting Get there around. with this one now. Yeah. Uh, you alright? Got me to drink it and spit it in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> No, I can do it, Dad. She doesn't normally drink this early. As <laughs> no, it's Christmas, we'll let it off. We'll let her off for that. Yeah. No, I don't. But yeah. I can nearly hold it like I showed you last time. Yeah. Nearly hold it one hand. When I get to yeah. the second one, then I'll be able to. Yeah. Um, but these are the fun times. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Jeffrey. Hi, Steve. Steve McInerney's on there. Oh, yeah. God. <laughs> There goes the neighbourhood. <laughs> Hi, Steve. <laughs> oh, one of da my dad used to be a policeman and um, one of his uh, um, workmates. Workmates. Yeah. Uh, policeman Steve no. McInerney's just come on. Um, and they still have a lot of fun together. <laughs> Yeah, I prefer work, Mason, friend. <laughs> oh, Steve, what have you done wrong now? You, you've gone yeah, down in, in yeah. levels again. <laughs> he's, in, he's in trouble now. Yeah. Rough head, your dad. <laughs> oh, I think that's what it says. <laughs> Hi, Pamela, how are you? Hi, Harriet. So... Like I said, I hope everyone's having a wonderful Christmas. Yeah. Um, it's you aren't even there yet. It's still New Year's Eve, uh, Christmas Eve in um, uh, America. It'd be afternoon for you guys, and mm -hmm. in the UK it'd be just after midnight, um, mm. or just about midnight in the UK. So I hope you have a wonderful morning when you wake up. Oh, hi, Kayla. How are you, darling? Kane's Kayla's on. Say, uh, Merry Christmas. Oh, we'll give you a call once we've uh, finished this, darling. Merry Christmas after to you lunch, and Kane. And, uh, after lunch, yeah, when here, everyone's yeah. here, darling, we'll give yeah. you a call. <laughs> Steve's always in trouble. <laughs> yeah. Only the depth there is. Yeah. 
<laughs> Always. Uh, so, Millie. Oh, you alright, Chuggalope? You alright? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Millie, finish. You've got to drink the first one quick so then you can <laughs> tell her. Can you get me another one out, please, Dad? Um, okay, which one? We need which? to fill that fridge too. We haven't filled the fridge yet. Oh, isn't that the number yours, one priority? The northern air. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could turn this camera around. Our horse is asleep with his head resting on the side of the sheep. <laughs> At least he doesn't mind them. Mm. I never used to mind them. Um... All right, I'll go fill the fridge. <laughs> so, everybody, have a good Christmas. dogs are out. <laughs> Bruno, our chihuahua, thinks he's a rottweiler and he always comes out and growls at Reggie. Tess! Tessie! Oh. Our little Maltese has got a Santa suit on but she's off. She's running around now. We won't catch her. <laughs> so guys, I hope you all have a wonderful Christmas. I want to thank you all for your support over the last year. Um, as I said, you know, you guys are family now and and you always will be. Um, so, to you guys, Merry Christmas. Thank you again for all of your support. All the best, everyone. It's getting easier now. Yeah? Now I've just felt the car <laughs> Might be able to get it up, one hand it down. Yes, Amber, alcohol does slow my tremors down. As you saw at first, it was hard to get it up. Now, okay. no, not yet. <laughs> I think one more sip and then I should be able to get it up. One handed without having to hold it, too, and it does slow it down. But tomorrow I will be twice as shaky because of the, the rebound of the, um, the alcohol and you have the rebound tremors. Um, it's sort of like a normal person who get DTs, I suppose, the next morning after they've had a big night on the alcohol. Um, we get the ETs on top of our already <laughs> full on DTs. So it um it does help but it's a, a quick fix, it's not the fix and it's definitely not for the next day. Yeah, yeah, but that's right, alcohol does it makes your go away and the next day you're twice as bad. Yeah. And that's the problem and you know, that's always the scary and the worrying thing talking about alcohol with a central tremor. Sorry, I'm, I've drank so fast. <laughs> um, because, you know, the next morning you could wake up and need that drink again because you're too shaky and that's when you can turn into an alcoholic. Um, so it's not the, the thing. The fridge is well stocked, Pamela. That's Shane's pride and joy, that fridge. <laughs> He, every time there's a, he, he loves his alcohol shopping. Oh, gee. That doesn't mean I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> no, it doesn't. <laughs> that fridge is pretty easy by the time the afternoon's finished. Yeah. <laughs> Today the fridge will get a workout. You're only 25 and you got diagnosed at 15. Yeah. And that has it progressed much more did you have it when you were young or, or did you get it around your teenage years my kids all got it in their teenage years but i had it from when i was young mum was telling a story the other way uh, telling me the other week she said uh, she'd been watching a, a video and she said it reminded me when you were young and when you're a little kid she'd always I'd spill every drink she handed me 
and she'd always say, now don't spill it. And of course, she'd give it to me, I'd spill it, and mum would, because we didn't know what it was. Mum would, oh, sit down, Nick. I think I had to sit down to drink and hold it two hands till I was about 16. Nearly. <laughs> Nearly, yeah. So it was always, sit down, Nick, sit down. And, and mum used to dread when I'd say, can I have a drink, mum? She'd, oh no, this is gonna be all over the floor every time, so. But we worked it out. Yeah, we didn't work it out. We just had to deal with it. <laughs> oh, we'd love you to be here for a drink too, Amber. You noticed it in your teenage years. It slowly progressed worse. That you can control them better now. Yeah, it's um, it is hard, especially in your teenage years when you don't know why. No, I always thought it was me and I was a nervous person and um, you just think it's you. When I got diagnosed, it was good to think, well, it's not just me. There's an actual reason for it. So now... Now I can get it up there one-handed now um, and it gets easier, but like I said, tomorrow I'll be twice as bad. Um, but... They're the things that come with it. Tessie, come here. Come up here, Tess. Tessie, Tess. Uh, Bruno, come up here, say look. Here's the cranky pants, Bruno. Aren't you? You cranky pants? He's always cranky pants. He thinks he's a rock wheeler, this one. He's um, not very impressed in life, are you, mate? Everything's just so hard. Oh, and here's Tessie. Oh. <laughs> she needs a haircut again. Look at your face. Where's your face? Show them your pretty eyes. There you are. You got your Santa suit on? <laughs> you take it off as well. I know. Bruno tried he ripping does. it off her as soon as we put it on. He wasn't impressed. That's right, Amber, it is crazy how alcohol helps and they don't have a fix for us yet. If there's a fix in here, in alcohol somewhere, there's got to be a fix for us one day. Hopefully we find it. Until that day, we'll just keep shaking. Have to keep drinking. Oh. <laughs> no, not keep drinking, then you get twice as shaking. Yeah. So there you go, guys. I can get up to my mouth one-handed now. All right, guys. I'll say goodbye to you all. I've got to set up now, get ready for everyone to turn up and get ready for lunch. I love you all. Take care. Stay safe wherever you are. Um, and have an absolutely fantastic Christmas Day with all your family. Love you guys. And I will see you all on Tuesday. Bye, guys.